had done the tour, I had done the album, the tour, the album. The, you know, it was like I wanted a little bit of a change. When I was younger, I've had um, my three best friends. Till this day, I still have my Courtney, Jansen, and Laura Lynn. And I just, um, I don't know. The whole concept came up of me you know, me being with my girlfriends and us growing up with each other. And I just, I wanted to do a teen movie, but I wanted to do something that um, teenagers could watch and be touched by, you know. And all of them have their own little issues, but um, at the same time, they have each other. And at the end of the day, that's what matters. You know, you, we all have our problems, but if we have our friends there, we can talk to them about, you know, that makes you feel safe. And um, that was the whole idea behind the movie. I mean, Lucy herself, picking up on your character first of all, um, extremely strong in terms of, you know, she's the bond that keeps, keeps yeah. the three of these girls together. How much of, obviously, now I've understood your involvement in the film from the start, yeah. how much of that was, to a certain extent, a reflection on who you are and, you know, exactly? Well, the fact that Lucy, she wanted to get away from her small town and to, well, her excuse at the time was to go see her mother. But in her heart, she knew she was on her way to be in the contest. And I think I can kind of relate to that to a certain extent, you know, with me going off and leaving my small town, you know. But other than that, the character is totally different from me, definitely. Lucy is very, um, I don't, I think that was probably me four years ago, not now, you know. But Lucy is very naive and um, very shy. She's to herself a lot. and. So, but the thing that I really liked about Lucy is that she was very strong, and I, I really liked that. I mean, you know, having, having watched the film and spoken afterwards in lens to, you know, people who were watching the film who were like from 15 to 25, um, the general consensus that we've spoken to people is that girls seem to bond a lot stronger and a lot younger age than guys at that particular age. That's so true. I totally agree. I remember when I was like 12 and 13, my girlfriends, we had our backs, you know, like, we were very, very close. I don't know if that's a southern thing or if it's just a nationwide thing or if I like how it is, you know. And I think it's cool because when you make bonds like that, a lot of times, at that young of age, you do continue to keep that as you get older. Like, still to this day, when I go home and I see my cousin Larlin, we start off just where we left off, you know. Like, it's just like, hey, what's up, you know. It's, that's a, and that's a cool feeling to know that you have that. But the flip side of that as well, and we see this in the movie between, between the three of you, is girls can be extremely more envious of each other and a lot of quicker, in a, in a quicker period, in that they, they kind of fall out with each other. I can say things that there's a little bit more pressure between. You know, it's funny you say that because when those kind of issues started happening in school, I just left. At that age where you're like, that's my boyfriend, da 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 da, I left school and I started to do my thing, my singing thing. So, and I remember my girlfriends calling me up saying, why did this person do that? Or listen what happened. And I'm like, whoa, what's going on? It's just that stage you go through where you're, you know, you're wanting to look pretty and you're catching guys' attention. And you know, there's, there is, there's that little jealousy thing going on. But luckily I never really experienced that. I mean, aside from, from the experience of what you're putting on screen, can you um, describe to us first day on set, exactly what was going through your head, what was going when through your what heart. what now? Your when first day on set. I was shoot. so nervous the first day. Oh my gosh, was I nervous. Because it's so weird, because when I'm on stage and I'm performing, I feel so comfortable, but it, that was just a territory that I was new at. I didn't know what the hell I was doing, you know? But once I got on the, sta once I got on the set and, you know, you're in your clothes, you're in character, all your surroundings are really getting you into character. and. Um, you know, it just fell into place. So, uh, and I had, the team of people that were working with me were amazing, like Tamara, the director, and the cast that was with me, Taryn and, and you know, and Zoe, the, the girls. And we just, you know, we hit it off, it was cool. Picking up on Tamara first, I mean, obviously she's had experience before, and obviously you being very close to the project. How much, in terms of supportive, was she 
in terms of exactly how she felt the character should be played, in terms of well, what of you should be giving, how you should look? And well, of course there was. Um, you know, she definitely had her opinions on things. And, you know, if I had a question, she was really open to tell me. If I had a question, I would tell her. The lines of communication were open all the time. And, and I had two weeks before the thing even started for me to just to really get a general idea of the character. And, you know, so that was cool. That felt really, really good. I think that helped me a lot for the movie. I mean, obviously meeting the girls, Zoe and, and, and Taryn, obviously you'd met beforehand, but literally once the cameras are on, the lights are on, did your relationship grow with them day by day as filming sort of continued? Were they, you know, extremely aware of, you know, the background that you were coming from? I mean, obviously everyone knows who you are, but were they supportive of your move and also extremely you know, helpful in terms of... Oh, definitely. Throughout the whole thing. I mean, they give me their advice on things and they say, that was a good scene, Brittany, you know, because I'm new at this and I'd want to know. And, or if something happened with them, I'd be like, oh, that was really real. You know, like, we were totally there for each other. Yeah. In terms of um, the actual development of the film, you said you'd kind of developed the project from day one and kind of, yeah, exactly... As the film was being shot, were you also aware of exactly how the film was developing, how hands-on in terms of, obviously not in a, in a production role, but you were, were you sort of realising exactly what you originally thought every day when, once you saw the rushes and once you saw the... Was I aware of like when it was coming together? Yeah, how it was coming together. Oh my gosh, that was one of the coolest things in the world. Like, you know, you have this idea and then all of a sudden you see it on the big screen and you're like... I did that, man. That's cool, you know? That's like the best villain in the world. That's probably why this is one of the things I'm most proud of that I've done. Because it's just, you know, it's my little project.